Hey there guys, Brando here. Today I'm going to show you how to remove the faceplate off of a graphics card. I'll be putting that faceplate back on later after I have it painted. Let's go over the tools you need. I used a Phillips head screwdriver, as well as an M3 hex nut to Phillips adapter for the standoffs. There are four of them. So let's get started. Now there's only one Phillips screw on this card. It's kind of tricky to get at without taking off the fans in the heat sink. So we're going to start with that one first. Take the adapter and remove the four standoffs holding the plate on the card. Alright, we have our finished faceplate here. The screws, the adapter, and the graphics card. So let's go ahead and start to finish this up. After you get the faceplate set, start to screw on the M3 standoffs by hand, and then tighten them with the tool.
I like the way it turned out. I'm actually pretty proud of the way it turned out. And I only used a fraction of a can of glass dip. So I could save it for other parts of this project. However, there are some spots where I was a little rough on it and stretched the skin like coating, which you can't see on this camera, so here's a close up. Yeah, it's not pretty, but you can't tell at a distance, so that's nice. So if you liked what you see, leave a like, or a comment would be appreciated, and tune in next week.